Hello friends, this is Anand Pai, founder of Academy in Pursuit of Engineering Excellence. Today we are going to discuss one of the very important topic which might attract a number of engineering students today. That is admission to IIT Madras MS or PhD with or without gate. This is something good. You can get into MS or PhD without gate. In the previous video I had shown what is the advantage of doing MS. Now MS and MTech is considered to be on par. Okay. And in case a person wants to do a PhD in uh, his uh, yearning or his uh, um, inclination is to do research then obviously after BTEC he can as well go to direct PhD in IIT Madras. So now what is the thinking behind uh, IIT Madras to go for without gate also and what is the disadvantage? See when we go for MS or PhD with gate we get half time teaching allowance or teaching assistantship or half time research assistantship because if you go for mtech you will get half time teaching assistantship and if you go for ms or phd you get half time research assistantship so now what happens there is you sponsor yourself the government of india ministry of human resource development which is giving that hdra HDR half time research allowance is no longer going to give you that so now what is the uh, advantage of doing this? See, so nowadays GATE has become very competitive. Okay? There are people who have natural flair for engineering, who want to do research, but somehow couldn't get such a high rank in GATE. Because GATE needs a lot of dedications and different type of preparation to get high ranks. Now there might be some people who are actually good in research and have a inclination towards research and all the qualities required for good research but because of the competition here are not able to get into MS or PhD. Now IIT Madras has taken a good move to attract such kind of people who are genuinely interested in research. So now, now let us see now we'll go to the uh, website of IIT Madras and see what actually they see. Okay so, so I have opened the site research.iitm.ac.in This is the research admission portal of IIT Madras. Now here I have gone and downloaded the admission brochure. Now let us see the admission brochure. This is the research admission brochure of IIT Madras. Last date of registration is 31.3. It's already open. You can already apply for that. And till 31.3 you can go for application here. Okay. So now what are the main thing we have to see here? See, MS or PhD goes by gate. Okay. But even if you don't have gate, this time you have a window. Now that doesn't mean that your engineering concepts is weak and you will get it. No, you should have a good engineering concepts and general idea about what are you going to do. Okay. So here uh, I've gone for MS and PhD and MS admission. Uh, page here. Now here they are asking about financial assistance. See how much financial assistance you will get? Assistance you will get? You will get 31,000 rupees per month for the first two years and next 35,000 rupees per month for the next three years. And if you are doing MS in engineering or management, you are getting 12,400 rupees per month for the period of actually two years initially plus additional six months if the graduate test committee um, approves it okay if it recommends it you can get it okay so now we will see here admission without assistance now a few candidates may also be considered for admission to the phd ms program without assistance that is non hdra under regular category now here the eligible qualifications are same as regular hdra except qualifying national level examinations that is git now such candidates has to enclose a letter along with the application form stating that they may be considered for admission even without assistance. That is non HDRE. Now here, this is the advantage. Now even if you get selected using non HDRE scheme, if your performance is good and your uh, what do you say research um, uh, inclination or research aptitude is good, 
you they may also consider to get back to hdr now this will happen if you clear gate at a later stage for example after 6 months of this will start in july so might be in uh, next january you clear gate and then you may be consider for the hdra in a regular basis but you will lose 6 months of hdra that's okay because admission you were, you would have secured admission by then and afterwards you know placement is very good in iit madras and ms and mtech get almost equivalent pay and are considered by companies especially in core branches like mechanical or even applied mechanics uh, elect- electronics and communication cs they are considered on par with each other so that is an advantage of going for ms in iit madras okay i always say that after if you don't get mtech in iits next step is not mtech in iits next step is ms in iits because once you get the tag of iit you are the king in the sense i'm saying in a uh, very general way in the sense you can get good admission you can you can get a good uh, pay package and also good opportunities to work with okay now in addition to this there is one more very very important point that i want to state okay there is something called ms by entrepreneurship this is something our young students who have urge to start a new startups they can think about see here we have something called ms in entrepreneurship which is i recommend a lot for this because now what happens if you want to start a new startup by yourself you will have to spend a lot of money you will not get a lot of um, you will not get a lot of guidance okay and uh, f- chances of failure is more whereas here in iit madras if you get through ms in entrepreneurship then what happens you may be you are guided by bunch of very very competent professors along with a strong alumni backup as well as the people who have already done the startups and the experience is also with you in addition the chances of attracting funds will be high as well as investment in your startup is high if you have that iit madras stack okay so kindly consider this ms in entrepreneurship very nicely okay it will it can give a lot of opportunities and also when you go for some building uh, going for startup it actually improves uh, improves the nation and it is actually a very great service for the nation if you are going for this and mind you it is not that easy you have to struggle a lot after getting here but without struggle where you will get anything you have to struggle okay so with this i will stop my video here and best of luck kindly subscribe my channel and also tell me which further videos can i make so that uh, it will help the community at large okay? thank you very much